welcome back everybody so i wanted to make a quick video for you guys as uh i'm getting ready to get the maverick up for ready to go play in the sand we're going to utv takeover here uh within the next week so i had some questions um and i wanted to answer some stuff and let you guys know if you've been wondering what's up with the uh the utah uploads uh going out to moab so um just a rundown quick uh i guess you'd say series of events that happened from when we got out there till now now i know that we did the we did the trip in may towards like the end of may or whatever and <clears throat> so my intentions was whenever we got out there was is i wanted to uh edit videos as we went and kind of keep an update um i've not gotten all the footage from utah uh, finished and uploaded but i am working on it as i go and the reason why i stopped and didn't upload anything while i was out there was is because uh, i had gotten so much footage of everything that we had done that my laptop had the memory had completely filled up so i was saving stuff on sd cards Plus, the amount of time that it takes to upload or to edit and create a video and then upload it and stuff was uh, very time consuming. So I just saved all the footage that I had and then as I, my game plan was when I came back then I was going to work on it and uh, get it all uploaded. So that being in May and this is now September. Um, and the reason here's some of the reasons why the it's taken so long and they've been spread out is when I when I first came back from Utah the I was here for I was back home for like three or four days and then I got sick like real bad sick for about seven days uh, during that seven days uh, had a, went through a lot of pain uh, sickness uh, what in Rona it was um i think they called it at the time a gi virus uh bad stomach virus couldn't eat or drink anything for seven days it caused immense pain and i couldn't keep it down so then during that time i was out of work and i couldn't i didn't really feel like i guess editing and going through all the footage because i was in i was in rough shape so it took me about three or four weeks to recover from that completely so I started getting motivation, trying to, you know, get some of the videos and stuff. Motivation was the biggest key that kind of kind of took the wind out of my sails for a little bit. But then I started, you know, getting back into the groove, forced myself to get back into the groove and, and put videos and stuff up and get things going. So as time has went on, you know, there's there's been life stuff. Work's been pretty heavy, uh, having to work a lot especially on the weekends uh, we've had a couple small trips but nothing big because everybody's super busy um, and then recently here i think it's been three weeks from today three weeks and two days uh, my father passed away and then you know that's that was a hard hit um has been for myself anybody that's ever experienced it you know some people aren't close to their parents and I was super close to mine so that one that that one caused me to personally take a hit um, I'm still working you know I'm, I'm still motivating to do better and, and get better and and uh, keep things rocking and rolling don't let it stop you know so what we've got going on right now uh, you're gonna see a couple videos um, getting prepped up or I'm gonna get the Maverick ready. I'm uh, gonna get it all cleaned up because it's literally it's been on the trailer for about three weeks. Uh, we've had a we had a trip to Ride Roll Blue, um, and you know I washed it up a little bit before I left there, and it's kind of just sat. Um, I'm gonna get it. I got some parts. Some parts still coming. We've got some parts here. We're gonna get this thing ready for sand mode. Um, I just wanted to say, uh, you know, across the board, everybody that's, you know, shared our videos, uh, subscribed to the channel, bought any merchandise or anything like that, no matter how big or small the purchase is, 
you know, I appreciate it. Um, there's some videos to come. Um, I'm going to be basically prepping this thing to get ready for Little Sahara. Um, I was not going to be able to make the trip um, due to everything that's been going on and uh, having to miss work and uh, with the funeral, you know, st stuff to deal with that. And then personally, um, friends chipped in and got me back in the game, get me ready for this uh, to make sure that I could go on the trip. And I greatly appreciate it. If you don't have good friends that are willing to support you like that around you, you can get rid of them, get better friends. Um, use people to help motivate you, you know, not compete with you and, and tear you down whenever they have a chance, you know, like, you know, everybody hits a hard spot in their life. And, you know, if you got friends that are willing to, um, to jump in and make sure that you don't fall harder than you could, those people rock. So that's my, my little, uh, short video, maybe a channel update. Um, I appreciate everyone, like I said, even all, across all the other social media platforms, people on the Facebook page, people on Instagram, you know, companies that, uh, that come in and, and uh, have supported us or asked us to do small things, small tasks and stuff for them, which is really big to us. But, you know, appreciate you guys for believing, you know, believing in a, a small channel, small people. You know, a lot of people run towards somebody that's got hundreds of thousands and millions and millions of subscribers and a following that they can see but they don't know and you know it's awesome uh, to get that kind of support from you know companies that uh, don't have to so anyways hope you guys enjoy the videos a uh, little Sahara coming up if you guys are going to be at UTV takeover and you see the freedom machine running around you guys give me a holler I thought I was done there for a second, but I'm going to throw this one in there real quick. Um, so, for the next videos to come, I'm going to show you guys these, what we got, uh, the setup for the Maverick. And a few bits and pieces, RPM, um, and then Infinity Off-Road. I'll tell you about that, and I'll tell you about uh, the RPM stuff that I got for the trip. And I've got um, Evo. Evo belts coming. Uh, I don't need a belt, but with what we're going to be doing in the sand, I'd rather put a brand new belt on uh, and just to keep everything safe. But yes, this is it. I'm out. Peace, y'all. Hope you're enjoying the videos and you'll enjoy the next ones.